had never been a bestseller. Given the setting, I was surprised to find that somebody had been passing time reading. The paperback was entitled, The Age of Murder and Storm. The blurb on the back mentioned Norse mythos and Ragnarok, the end of a Viking world with a terrible wind covered the earth and ice, when vile crimes were rampant and all humanity lost. I thought somebody impressionable might get it into their head that we were at the end of time. I was also beginning to see what the nightclub and its owner were all about. never been a bestseller. Given the and the occult had been piled on the table. The room was...
stacked with light reading, such as Necronomicon, Witchcraft, and Paradise Lost. Old exotic titles like Malleus Malficarum and De Umbrarum Rainy Novum Portis. Books with pentagrams on their covers, all dealing with the occult and the infernal. Lying between stacks of horror videos and a couple of Ouija boards. The only thing I could take seriously was the thought of Lupino taking it seriously. He had been spending a lot of time getting intimate with the guy downstairs.
The backstage area led to Lupino's inner sanctum. The hot air inside was like an invisible wall, thick with incense and something else. A sickly sweet smell that made you gag. This was the rotten core of the Big Apple. Lupino lurked somewhere ahead, like a spider at the center of his web, waiting. The vapors in the air started to make my head swim. Torn pieces of a letter lay scattered on the... Punchinello had threatened Lupino in writing. The note had been torn to pieces, bloody fingerprints all over them. Don't want you to think that one of my boys is not playing with a full deck. Shape up, Jack. We are running a business here. I'd hate to send the trio to strong arm you. The trio were the Don's notorious henchmen. It was obvious that Lupino hadn't been intimidated by the threat. Lupino's notes covered the table. Jack Lupino was crazy, all right. The table was scattered with notes of demented arcane nonsense written in rusty blood. A mishmash list of demons, devils, and dark gods evoked. Beelzebub, Asmodeus, Baphomet, Lucifer, Loki, Cthulhu, Lilith, Hela! Blood given to you all. He was after that old Faustian deal. Your soul for power and fortune. Just sign on the dotted line with your blood. Lupino's notebook lay on the pedestal. Jack Lupino was crazy, all right. Mythic wolves let loose to devour the sun and the moon. Lupino is the wolf. I'm Mr. Beast, the big bad Fenris wolf. I'm the end of the world man, wearing the flesh of fallen angels. After Y2K, the end of the world had become a cliche. But who was I to talk? A brooding underdog Avenger alone against an empire of evil, out to right a grave injustice. Everything was subjective. There were only personal apocalypses. Nothing is a cliche when it's happening to you. The flesh of fallen angels! Come to me all! Astaroth, Beelzebub, Asmodeus, Baphomet, Lucifer, Loki, Satan, Cthulhu, Lilith, Ella! Blood to you all! Oh, I'm the wolf, yeah! I am! 
am the wolf! 